morning and welcome to Paris and Christmas. Good morning, Merry Christmas. What am I saying good morning for? Merry Christmas. Hope you're having a wonderful one wherever it is you are right now. I'm just bouncing around, listening to some Christmas carols on my wheel, hanging out in the Louvre. I totally expected this place to be completely empty because I thought it would be closed. Nope, lots of people here. That's okay. I had to enjoy a little bit of Christmas cheer and bounce around. And that's basically it. I just thought I'd check in and see how you were doing for Christmas. I hope you're having a good one. Feel free to let me know how it is below. If you're having Christmas by yourself or you're feeling a little bit lonely today, you're not alone. I'm spending Christmas alone, more or less. I do thankfully have some other expat friends in town who are stuck alone and we're gonna have a little dinner together. But in the meantime, yeah. Just thought I'd share a few shots of Christmas in Paris, even though it looks like any other sunny winter day in Paris right now. We can hop over to Place Vendôme though. That didn't make it into my Christmas lights video and uh, you know, at least get some Christmas trees in there. Mm -hmm. It's always Christmas tree mania over here in Place Vendôme. Although these Christmas trees are much larger. Last year I think there were just more. However, on the outside, they've got quite a lot going on still with the Ritz and everything else. Not a bad spot to hop through if you're looking for some Christmas trees, Christmas tree photos. And today the weather is fantastic for some photos. Blue skies and man, Christmas. It's just crisp, chill all around. Pretty delightful. For those of you wondering what I'm listening to right now, I was listening to like the classic hits, like, you know, All I Want For Christmas Is You and all those kinds of things. But I just switched it to a childhood favorite, Michael W. Smith's Christmas Time. Was it? Like, The Happiest Christmas, I think, is the first song on. It's probably the best Christmas album ever. At least it's my favorite. So I'm listening to that, feeling a little nostalgic and wheeling around and looking at Christmas trees and thinking of my family and can't wait to see them again in a couple of months. But, again, just thought I'd, you know, share a little bit of Christmas with you. The nice thing is that uh, I don't have to just wheel around. For those of you that have been missing the wheel, that's my Christmas present to you as well, because I know a number of you have been missing the wheel and wondering where it was. The wheel works best in conjunction with the Metro, which is why I haven't been using it as much. I've been biking a lot more, but I can use line one today, which is why we're using it and still getting around and getting a little extra footage of places like this and like this. Of course, the nice thing is that even if the strike is still on, Line one's still running, so you can still get to a couple of really nice spots on the town, especially with the weather so nice. Gotta put the wheel to a little bit of use going around in circles, right? I think so. And what better circle to go around than this one? Bouncing around on the wheel, it's time to go have my Christmas dinner. I had a Christmas dinner last night, a Christmas Eve dinner with Pushan and his mom. And I'm headed to an expat orphan's Christmas, for those of us who don't have family here. Have some drinks in the afternoon and uh, call it a delightful Christmas. Yeah. Why? What were you going to say? <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Well, anyways, this is an amazing apartment and Christmas has officially started. That's it. I can, that, okay. Now what do you want to say? Okay. So, I think maybe I have to sear it first. Good job, 
amazing. Do you know what to do? No, kind of. I just, I just, I don't know. Oh, I didn't know there was a scene. And it's literally no one else streaming because you're the new kind of an unnecessary Are you left handed? Yeah. Well, I don't know, that's gonna work. Well, it's gonna f up. Don't you gotta do it with purpose. Hold on, Noah, Noah. You have to do it with purpose. But Noah. Whoa! He opened it. <laughs> Guys, this was purposely done. That's a little more purpose than I was looking for. It's pretty good. <laughs> done with purpose. Oh, it might be a little bit dangerous oh, to drink. It's okay. Your what? Oh, your pride? And your pants? Don't worry, Simon. Why was your... You destroyed that thing. You should be very proud. Well, she said do it with purpose. I purposely did that. <laughs> that was... Ah. That was good, that was good, that was good. I'm keeping my shoes on for the night, that's all I'm saying. We do have a cocktail maker here for the second attempt, so we're gonna get we're gonna get a good savored champagne bottle out of this one way or another. We're supposed to do the angle properly. Oh! Oh, no ceremony. And you went. No ceremony? I might not have been able to film it, but there's no top to that bottle anymore, so that's what happens, yeah. That's how it goes. Is it the spinach? Yeah. What is it? 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 What is it